before us stands a group of unsuspecting adventurers ensnared in the treacherous web of the KTV labyrinth. Sexiest girls in Cebu. <laughs> what price date, that's it. But I don't want to finger up my butt all. Something very special here in Cebu that I want to show you. Something you need to be aware of. And the ladyboys are out harassing guys, trying to get some business. It's the wild west out here, my friends. And that's why I kind of like it. I'm sure you would give me a nice blowjob. What would you charge for a blowjob? It's 1,000. 1,000? Okay. No. How much? I don't want a blowjob. Yeah. Here's all the street girls, yeah. Yeah, we Where is this? Street girls are out. <laughs> Over here. I don't want massage, thank you. How much do you charge for massages? For all the way, one five. One five, all the way. Yeah. Single, no baby. Single, no baby. Wow, you like a diamond in the rough. <laughs> How old are you now? I'm good in low jump. Wow. Come on, just try. I have good service. I bet you do. But I don't need low job right now. I don't want anything. I just want to see what this place. Oh, it's a fucking KTV. It's a KTV. What is Chuba Chuba? There, Yeah, what is that? Oh, massage. With a happy ending. Oh yeah. Today's episode, it is all about that place right over there, X O. And there's a place next door as well over there, like a massage place. Hi. Hi sir. How are you? That's good. First time. Your first time, yeah, yeah. So, how does it work, yeah? Here is a full back massage. Yeah. Yeah, include a prostate massage. What about? For prostate, that's it. Yeah. But I don't want to finger up my butt all. Did you guys do the yeah. hand job? Yeah, it's a okay hand job. Uh, what about a pool, the pool service, like boom boom? No, not allowed boom boom. Not allowed boom boom. Yes, but you can touch the girl. I can touch a girl. Yeah, but it's up to you, the girl and. You and the room. It's up the agreement. But the one. How many girls you got working here? It's only one. <laughs> you? For you. It's one. I know, she's young. <laughs> Why don't you bring them all out and then I can choose yeah. one? You want to choose? Come on, guys. If you're in Cebu, there's two things you need to watch out for. KTV bars and the street girls. Why? Because the street girls are... What? We have another person. We have a young and beautiful girl. KTV? Yeah. What is bar find here? Where you just uh, talk to the girl first? You want? You choose first to pay uh, 100 for the drugs. Cebu, where debauchery reigns supreme and every shadow hides a tale of excess and indulgence. Welcome, dear viewers, to the twisted den of vice known as XOXO Bar, or maybe it's called Zozo. Tucked away 100 meters from General Maxilom Avenue, here in this multifunctional labyrinth of sin, the boundaries blur between reality and fantasy. It's a vortex of hedonism where the lines between pleasure and pain, desire and disillusionment are eternally blurred. Step inside and you're greeted with a symphony of sights and sounds that assault the senses like a slap in the fucking face. The sirens of Zozo, these so-called bar girls, beckon with their siren songs. Their beauty, a weapon as lethal as it is alluring. They dance on the stage, their movements hypnotic, their allure irresistible. But beware, dear traveler. Check out our explosive videos dropping like atom bombs on my subscription page. Exclusive content, maps, and access to our elite Discord channel. Because in the world of shady adventures, we all need to stick together like glue. 
Some are mere spectacles, meant to titillate and tantalize without ever truly being attainable. But beware the dreaded lady drink, a concoction so absurdly priced that even the most seasoned revelers will find themselves choking on their own disbelief. 600 fucking pesos for a single drink. Madness, it's sheer fucking madness I tell you. And yet amidst the chaos and the carnage, there is a strange sense of order. The Mama Sun, a figure both feared and revered, holds court over a flock with an iron fist. She is the gatekeeper to this kingdom of sin, the arbiter of desire and the keeper of secrets. But be warned dear viewer, for every pleasure in Zozo comes at a price. A steep price to pay for a fleeting moment of ecstasy in the heart of darkness where the only rule is to indulge, to excess and to embrace the madness that lurks within us all. I was just inside there and three guys just got fucking rinsed. Wallets cleaned out. Why? They're obviously not watching this channel. If you do happen to watch this channel, then truth bombs are dropping like fucking bombshells here, keeping you guys safe. Behold, my nocturnal comrades, a cautionary tale of the highest order. Before us stands a group of unsuspecting adventurers ensnared in the treacherous web of the KTV labyrinth. Like lambs to the slaughter, they wandered into the lair of the cunning fox, unaware of the dangers that lurked within. In the dimly lit confines of the KTV booth, the drinks flowed like a raging river in the dead of winter, each glass leading them further down the path of ruin. They were naive, my friends, ignorant of the true nature of this den of iniquity. They assumed foolishly that the prices would be reasonable, but alas, they were sorely mistaken. I sought out the Mama Sun, that wily gatekeeper of temptation, to inquire about the unfortunate incident. Her words cut like a knife through the haze of deception, revealing the grim truth of their folly. In a mere 40 minutes, they had managed to accumulate a staggering bill of over 500 US dollars with nothing to show for it but bitter regret and shattered illusions. It happens, it happens to the best of us. Everybody, even the most seasoned professional is going to get rinsed in a place once in a while. And that's when you least expect it. But yeah, they had one friend that... They had one friend that was... Uh, <laughs> here he comes. I think he's going to, he went to go to my... He was angry earlier and he just fucking rushed out. I don't think they got enough money. So check how the girls are calming the guys down there so they doesn't freak out too much. The power of pussy, man. The power of pussy. It's a little bit more expensive than the other bars, but the caliber of gold there is way higher than the other bars. My dear subscribers, heed this warning well, for the streets are fraught with peril for the uninitiated. Arm yourselves with knowledge gleaned from the depths of my videos, lest you too fall prey to the siren songs of vice and excess. Stay vigilant, stay untamed, and above all else, stay true to the spirit of the night. For in this world of shadows and deceit, only the freaks and the fearless shall emerge unscathed. Game. Until next time, my friends. Where are you from? South Africa. You go waka waka. Yeah, waka waka. Hey, hey, that's it. Hey, hey. Yeah, there we go. And why you are white? Well, because they are all white people in South Africa. Shakira is white. But no, Shakira. She's, pure, um, I don't she's not South African. Sorry? Shakira is not South African. So, how much do you charge? For what? For short time? For short time, yeah. Only, only 1,000 per month. Only 1,000. <laughs> Right. Which time only? Which time only? And you work this strip all the time? Yeah. What's okay. your name?